Okay. It's 2022. It, we just got a lot to talk about. We got a lot to dive in on. Um, I've been living. <laughs> I've not picked up this camera because your girl has been living. Um, so many updates, so many changes, so much growth. So many falls, so much, so much has happened. But today I'm picking up the camera. I'm starting off my week because I'm gonna be start vlogging weekly. Um, before this video goes up, I'm pretty sure I'm gonna have a sit down video just explaining or maybe tidbits. I don't know how I'm gonna do it yet, but I'm picking the camera up today just to talk some shit. But um, I wanted to give this like quick introduction before I kick into everything that's going on today. I have a nice little to do list. I'm currently working. Um, but just took a little break break to come here and talk to y'all. Um, I'm about to go look at some apartments later. So that is the start of this vlog in this week, I would say. Um, I'm in Atlanta. And we are apartment searching. I have already went and looked at two spots. I'll throw those clips in there. So give me the Florida ceiling windows, feels, this closet situation, definitely can make it work though. I can make this work. A lot of natural sunlight, TV, couch. Well, yeah. Um, but I want to look at two more and then tonight I'm making my final decision on where it would be my new home um, And yeah, so So excited <laughs> I'm at my homegirl's house. She is um, out working or whatever and I'm working too. So we both working and then she's we're gonna meet up um, At noon to go look at the first place and then I go look at the other place to like 4.15 ish I think is when my tour is. Um, that's the earliest I can like break out of work. So <sighs> just, you know, real cute today. Kinda wanna some like mountain vibes or whatever. But I'ma bring y'all with me when we head out. So this is like the prequel before the turn up. And I gotta make sure everything is aligned. So on my today, on today's um to-do list because I've been finding that writing actual to-do lists have been way more effective for me in my personal and work life because I'll be I'm scattered brain I'll be trying to remember everything and then it don't be working out that way so um, my mom was like write write it down like stop trying to feel like you have to remember everything so I've been doing that and it's been really working so for today I have to go so a couple of places, I need to go to Lowe's, I need to go to Sam's Club, I want to pop into Sephora, I need to go to Xfinity and get my cable stuff set up for my new place. Um, I need to go confirm and do my paperwork with the moving company that's going to be moving my stuff. Um, I got to get some cleaning supplies, I got to get Valentine's Day gifts, I have a lot of things to do. So I woke up semi-early, I woke up at like 9, I knew it was going to take me a minute to get dressed, it's 11, so I'm about to like finally walk out the door, I ordered me a smoothie from Tropical Smoothie, um, because I'm not hungry, but I know I need to like get something in me to get my day going, so I usually just grab a smoothie on Saturdays, um, to just kind of, you know, kickstart that, but I wanted to kind of show y'all like my beginning moving process, because I have like tried to organize things and move things, I just have a lot of shit. <laughs> and when it comes down to it, I realize I just have a lot of stuff. So I'm going to be doing some downsizing, a lot of donations. I was going to try to sell it, but I just don't have the time to do it at this given point. So, um, yeah, I'm just going to just donate it to somebody who, who could possibly use it. All of that is like everything that was in my drawers that I am deciding to keep. It's clean. Um, this is like the pile that I started of like giveaway stuff. I need to go through this. All of my drawers, well, not this one, not these two, but like this drawer and these drawers are empty. I have some of my glasses here. And then we come over to this room. This is actually where most of my stuff is at. So like I wash all my clothes and now they're all on hangers. And um, I'm gonna take them off the hangers and put them in this container. Only because I realized the hangers that I have, some of them, I don't want them. 
I don't like moving and moving with hangers because they get in the way, they get caught on stuff. It's just annoying. So I'd rather just take everything off the hanger um, and put it in containers. And that way I can kind of organize it a little bit better. I have some more donation stuff that I pulled from out of here. I have some of my good coats that I haven't been able to pull out and wear. Um, I have my purses over there. I told you I'm going on vacation, so I have like some of the vacation looks that I want to bring with me already like separated from over there some of my shoes is like laid out over here um because i did like clean out my closet the bathroom is a whole nother story on getting that together um and now i'm saying i can wear this jacket yeah i'm about to wear this jacket for the day um so just a lot of moving parts to be completely honest but i'm a person i work better under pressure like I thrive on last minute shit. It's not last minute, but it is. Um, so I'm gonna just go get the materials and things that I need so that way this evening I could just kind of bust it out. Now you know your girl loves a good camo. So this is the look. My purse is downstairs, like my um my one that I had on yesterday, so I can transfer all my stuff over. Let me show y'all the full like full body body yaddy yaddy yaddy. This is the full body. Just docks. I switched my laces out for like these yellow jagged looking laces that I got when I was in Houston. Um, jeans, t-shirt, that's where we're going. I don't really wear my docks too often because they're uncomfortable, but we're gonna try to break them in as much as possible. And yeah, this is me running errands for today. I realized after I put this red lip on, Putting a mask on top of it is not gonna be great. And then look what I just did. Phone hit the damn thing. So I'm gonna bring some makeup wipes because this is gonna be a pain for the day. But Lego, I'm excited. I'm vlogging, I'm moving. This is a new like chapter that I'm about to start. Just, I don't know. I'm elated. <laughs> Do we have a problem? It's not auto -tune on me, is it? Nope. Yo, Nicki Minaj is back. She went crazy on that, on that damn. <laughs> Do we have a problem? She a little demon off that Casamigos. <sighs> that Casa, I'm putting shit. You know how you listen to a song? got captioned so I'm putting it in my caption book in my phone but I just got to Sam's Club I went and got my uh, tropical smoothie only I would drink a smoothie when it's fucking 30 degrees outside but here we are I got some boxes. I got two large boxes and two medium boxes. Um, don't really know what I have planned to go in the boxes, but I knew I needed at least some type of boxes to start point alongside the two containers that I have. Um, honestly, probably some clothes in either or, and then use one of those for like shoes or whatever. Um, and then when I was in Walmart, I got the um, mattress protector and mattress cover. So. Um, I don't want my mattress to be like exposed and out so I have this and it zips up while it travels Um, and then my box spring I actually bought it from Amazon so it comes in like it, I could break it down into a smaller box So I'm gonna do that. I got these six extra large Space bags these things. Let me tell y'all them just being a one for travel like because I am an overpacker For traveling. I always use these um, I was like, I can get them for moving. So they improved, have to improve their bag because I used to just buy whatever space bags that didn't require um, a vacuum because who be having vacuums when they in hotel rooms and on vacation and stuff. So you usually just like pull um, all the air out of it and roll it. But they upgraded to, you can either use the vacuum or not. My mom has a vacuum, so I'm gonna use the vacuum of course to shrink these and use it. Um, and it's gonna make my trip so much easier. Sheesh. And I bought a box cutter because I'm about to get my nails back done and I don't want to be using my nails as a damn shit shit. Um, 
Let me see. Let's see how big they are. But like, they're huge. And that's, that's what we like. Fuck in the box up. Okay. So. Um, like this. This is what they look like. Oh, no, these are huge. Oh, yeah. I'm about to get it so popping with these. I'm going to start with pulling out everything that I'm going to need for the next, at least, mm, two weeks. Because I'm going, I have all next week. And then I have vacation. Then I come back from vacation. So I need some stuff then. So maybe I should use two of these. Now, one should be fine. Okay, yeah. Let me figure out what is not getting packed up right now. And then we go from there. I feel like I have so much stuff to do, but I really don't. But I do, but I don't, but I do, but I don't. But I got everything I needed today, which was like A1 day one. Um, and I can show y'all all that I got too when I go back downstairs to the garage. Because that's where everything is currently living. So, let go. It's heavy as fuck. So I'm actually going to um, open this because the way that it shrunk down, it shrunk like weird. So I think laying it flat is the best option. Oh my God, this is so heavy. Um, and then once you just you open it, the air just comes back. It just pop open. But definitely worth the investment. These are like the giant, like the biggest, biggest ones. So this six pack cost me, I want to say like $30, but it's worth it. Cause you can, I'm able to like fit so much more stuff in it. So I'm gonna lay it flat this time and do it. And you just put the whole, put the joint on there and bada boom, bada bang. I'm so excited. I woke up this morning and I was just like, it's starting to really hit me that I moved and I had to give myself a little bit of grace. Give yourself some grace. That's like my thing for 2022. Um, I just celebrated a birthday. I'll go ahead and insert some clips there. 